Arsenal Fan TV, Claude, um, embarrassing today, mate? The whole thing is embarrassing. Um, he, he sabotaged his football club when he signed that new contract in May, as far as I'm concerned. And it's not going. And it's not going to get better. But I'm afraid our fans have got a lot. A lot of our fans have got a lot to blame because not enough of you got behind it in, in last year. Not enough got behind the protest. Not enough of you got behind it. You you got what you deserved. I'm afraid, and, and that's what we're getting. And uh, I mean, it, you know, I was surprised at the the, the team selection. You know, especially no, looking at some of the results from yesterday's game. I'm not you know? surprised. I'm not surprised. To, I'm not surprised about the, the team selection because we have got Chelsea in the semi final. I'm not no, but at least have a few players on the bench that if it goes wrong, we got away right. with it against right. West Ham, well, where we only, you know... To be honest with you, there's players on the bench that would have been better on playing than players that are actually playing that want to get away from this football club. So why are we playing them? If they want to get away from this club, why are we playing them, right? People like Eddie or... Why can't he... As soon as he came, as soon as he came on the pitch... He looked sharp. He looked all right. He looked quite good, didn't he? Mm. The only one that I think that could take any fucking anyone that can take any credit today was Reese Nelson. Mm. At least he was trying and he was pushing. But the rest of them, they're a joke. The whole, uh, the whole, the whole setup's a joke. The whole thing is a joke. And we, we are to blame, mate. The fans are to blame, and we are all to blame for this shit. I'm sorry. I've got to go. I've got my coach is going to go. That's all I need after today is losing the coach. Sorry.